Taking a look at the WVTT community calendar. Kane Community Hospital is offering free blood pressure screenings during the entire month of February. It's happening at all of their clinics and it's part of the initiative to raise awareness about heart health that's going on at Kane Community Hospital. February is Heart Month. Now, if you see news happening, you can be a WVTT tipster. Telephone 716-372-9564. You can uh, also email us, news at colonialme.com. And Facebook us. That's facebook.com backslash WVTT news or on Twitter at WVTT25. Lots of ways to communicate with us, and we do follow up with all of our news tips here at WVTT. Finally tonight, a family takes a wild ride with a seal. A bandit uses fruit as the weapon of choice. The latest video that will have you talking, it's right now. And take a look at this. An Australian family had an unlikely guest pop up on their boat. A young fur seal jumped aboard. The family caught the adventure on camera. You can see the playful animal made himself right at home. It was so cute just sitting and sunbaking. The seal tagged along for the ride about 30 minutes before being put back into the water. That didn't stop him from chasing the boat. It was just a once in a lifetime experience. I don't think it'll ever happen again. Pineapples, pumpkins and melons. Oh my. Police in New Rochelle, New York are looking for a fruit bandit. They say someone is using fruits and vegetables to vandalize parked vehicles. One woman found the back window of her car was smashed. The weapon? A piece of melon. People don't deserve this. Now I gotta pay money out of my pocket. Police say at least nine cars were torpedoed by produce last week. An organ man has hit the streets looking for a new kidney. Earl Martinez has Alport syndrome and needs a transplant. His family can't donate because it's a hereditary disease. The 28-year-old is on a three-year wait list for his blood type, which is O. He has a Facebook page called Earl Needs a Kidney with information on how people can help. For Take a Look at This, I'm April Williams. And I guess having your car damaged by a melon is better than having your melon damaged by a melon. Let's take a look now at the WVTT Severe Weather Action Team forecast, and here's meteorologist Jim Rinaldi. Now the Twin Tiers official forecast for the lower elevations today. We'll have mostly cloudy skies with snow showers and some heavier lake effect snow. There was a lake effect advisory in effect that'll continue into the night tonight with 36 inches accumulating by tomorrow morning. High this afternoon will be 18 degrees, low tonight 6 Remains rather cloudy for the day tomorrow with additional snow showers. We'll have more accumulation coming. Temperatures are going to hold steady right around 6 degrees for our high temperature tomorrow. Wednesday is going to be mostly cloudy with a couple of snow showers around the high 8. In the higher elevations, we're looking for mostly cloudy skies with snow showers and heavier lake effects snow through the night tonight with another 4 to 8 inches by tomorrow morning. The high this afternoon, 22, low tonight, 6. Brutally cold for tomorrow with clouds and additional snow showers. More accumulation is likely high 10. Snow showers will continue on Wednesday, high 8. I'm WVTT's weather action team meteorologist Jim Rinaldi and WVTT. Depend on it.